Hello everybody, this is Dennis Hesberger from the Creation Forum and um, well, this is our first tutorial which is meant to show you how to create your show on a Creation 2 console, well how to create a new show and how to patch your fixtures. So basically we're going to start a create new show. Um, we have our console door on PC booted up and we click on create new show. So I do that. Now if you notice um, that you can, can enter your show name in here and if I type demo show which is a show I have previously created you will see over here that um, we get this little warning sign that tells us that this show name is already existing so we're going to type demo number two after that we just click on enter and you see it opens up a new show called demo two um, its initial size on the hard disk is 48 kilobytes which is quite small. So um, then we have a few tabs over here and I will go into detail with those tabs um, later on in the next tutorial. So just let's go to the show setup and make sure we add the fixture setup pane over here and then let's click on add fixtures. So now I can choose my manufacturer on the left side let's choose GLP and my type of the fixture on the right side let's choose an impression. So we click on next, then we can enter how many fixtures we would like to add. So I'm going to add eight fixtures. You can invert pan or tilt um, for those fixtures, or you can define that this fixture should not react to the Grandmaster. Right now it reacts to the Grandmaster, now it would not. So we leave it like it is and click on next. Now we need to map those fixtures onto the button panel, which we have here. Um, those two first rows are page number one, second rows are page number two, and so on. We have eight columns, um, so this is our eight buttons we have per row in our button panel. So we click on number one, or row number first, first button on row number one, and you see that we get this. If we click on the fifth button, it'll look like this. Let's stick with that. So we'll click on next. Now we can enter an address. We can either sel only select an universe and let the console automatically patch everything to that universe, or we can say manual patch and enter an address by ourselves, or we can say no patch. We'll leave that on auto patch for this one. Now we click on finish and the console will tell us it has, eight, has patched eight fixtures and over here you will see that button number one to eight on fixture page number one are now being used with those fixtures. So let's click on OK and we click on add fixtures again to add another type so I'm going to GLP again and um, let's just take some well what are we going to take uh, or to pick? We're picking some impression RZ. So we click on next again we enter eight fixtures again we click on next. Now you notice that on the first row there are eight impressions. If you click on that you will see that the last three columns or buttons in that case turn red. So it, it means we cannot map our fixtures over here. So we click on that and you see it's all green and good to go. So we click on next again. Then we click on manual patch because we would like to add the, the address manually. You'll notice that this will show the next three address on the universe number one. Um, if you aren't sure whether uh, there are no, enough free addresses to add your fixtures in a well in some blank space between two other fixture groups you can click on select address here it will show you which addresses are used um, by indicating a red number or indicating them by a red number you will see that the mix address 113 is green so that means the mix address 113 would be the next free Again, if we click on a used slot, you will see that the background color turns red to show you you cannot add that fixture here. If we scroll down, we see that with that selection, it would use um, the addresses until address 229. So let's just click on 113 and click on OK. So it shows 113 over here. Uh, we click on Finish and basically we're done. You could have a look at the patch fixtures sheet to um, actually have a look at the addresses um, or to repatch fixtures. 
Well, basically that was our first tutorial. Thanks for watching and I hope you liked it.